Have you ever wondered why diesel engines are more efficient than gasoline ones? Watch this video to find out. There are a few factors which have a great impact and a great influence on diesel engines efficiency. Things that a gasoline engine will never achieve. So there are a few factors to consider but the most important thing to consider when it comes to engine efficiency is compression ratio. The higher the compression ratio, the higher the mechanical efficiency of the engine. And that's one of the most important factors when it comes to diesel engines efficiency. Gasoline engines can't exceed a compression ratio of 14 to 1. And if you have a 14 to 1 compression ratio like in the Mazda 3 with a 2 liter gas engine, naturally aspirated, 120 horsepower, 14 to 1 compression ratio, you would need 100 octane rating gasoline. We cannot exceed 14 to 1 in a gasoline engine because simply gasoline would auto ignite like diesel fuel does. When gasoline auto ignites, we have engine knocking. We need to ignite the gasoline via a spark plug. In diesel engines, diesel fuel auto ignites. So basically, having a higher compression ratio will force the diesel fuel to auto ignite. And when we talk to diesel fuel quality, we are talking about cetane rating, which is the opposite of octane rating. In octane rating, we don't need any engine knocking or any auto ignition. In diesel engines, we want for the diesel fuel to auto ignite as fast as possible. And that measurement is done by the cetane rating. That's the fuel quality that we're looking for when it comes to diesel fuel. 50, 51, 55 cetane rating. That's all about diesel fuel quality. So in a diesel engine, we are forcing fuel to auto ignite by having a large compression ratio. And that's why gasoline engines can't achieve uh, this efficiency. We have a much lower compression ratio. It's almost double. Uh, most gasoline engines have 9, 10, 11 compression ratio with few exceptions, 12, 12.5. Turbocharged gasoline engines have an even lower compression ratio because we need to introduce to force more air and more fuel to burn to get more power. By increasing the amount of air and the amount of fuel, we would need a larger combustion chamber. And by having a larger combustion chamber, we can't have a higher compression ratio. The higher the compression ratio, the smaller the combustion chamber. Another great factor for diesel engine's efficiency, why it's better than gasoline ones, is because diesel fuel has more energy than gasoline. Diesel fuel has around 10% more energy content than gasoline. So, so basically, we need to burn 10 liters of diesel fuel and 11 liters of gasoline to achieve the same amount of energy. So diesel fuel has more energy and by having a compression ratio, we significantly increase the engine's efficiency. And the third most important thing when it comes to diesel engine's efficiency comes to the speed of the flame, the speed which the diesel fuel burns within the engine. So basically it burns slower, that's why we can't have 10,000 RPM in a diesel engine, uh, diesel fuel burns much slower. If it burns slower and it packs more energy and we, if we have a higher compression ratio, it means that we can drive our diesel engine at much lower RPM. By driving at much lower RPM, means that we don't need to rev the engine too much and to decrease the mechanical efficiency. So we basically lose less uh, mechanical energy because we don't have that much friction by driving a diesel engine at let's say 1500 RPM compared to a gasoline at 3000 RPM. At 3000 RPM we have more friction, more energy loss compared to 1500 RPM. So all these things summed up result in around 40 to 45 percent efficiency for our diesel engine while for our gasoline engine we have 20 to 35 so gasoline engines are not that efficient as diesel ones but you know diesel have their downsides as well personally i don't like diesel engines they're noisy they're loud they have the dpfs they don't rev that much uh, they have cold starting issues uh, and the list goes on. Uh, personally for me gasoline is, is the way to go, but diesel engines have their advantage. And if you drive a lot, especially outside town, if you have a truck, if you have a bus, if you have, uh, I don't know, if you travel a lot on the highway, a diesel engine is just fine. It, it's excellent. 
So let me know in the comment section below if you have any questions on engine efficiency. And as always, thank you for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already for more car videos. And I'll talk to you guys in the next one.